is I lay here on the table that my former employer gave me as a present for all of us. I realized that it's already August and I realized that summer is almost gone. Now a few things are gonna happen in August. In my country it's like the it's like the big month it's like the big holiday month meaning that most of the companies are closed uh, around this time at least for one week maybe two weeks it means that most of the people in my country are gonna go on holiday most of them are gonna go back to their little town that they left in search for a better life uh, for study or work and um, to me this month is like a sort of a big illusion because a lot is happening at the same time and everywhere there is music there is some kind of party and there's people having fun it's not my favorite time of the year, it's, not, it's certainly not my favorite part of summer. I like June better, I like July better, but mostly June, because the days are getting longer and longer. I uh, can already smell hints of winter in the air, and I feel like this year is slipping from my fingers. It was January a while ago, it's August now, and I feel like it's gonna be Christmas soon. Last days and probably weeks, I would say, have been pretty hectic for me. A lot has been going on. Uh, it seems like every day there is someone calling me, asking me if I wanna do this or that. I mean, it could be normal, it's summer, you know, people is on holiday, people, people want to do things. Um, I'm not used to it, uh, as I um, live a pretty quiet life and um, this year I've been uh, alone most of the time and I also have to admit that I felt uh, loneliness a few times during this year uh, and there was nobody to talk to, uh, nobody to grab a coffee or have a beer or go for a walk or exercise together or whatever but now everything seems to be changed and I kind of turned myself into a yes man I try to say yes to everything I want to do things I want to create memories I want to live life I want to live life so there is a part of me that says yes go along with the flow try to do things try to live life try to have fun try to experience things, try to involve yourself in as many projects as you can. But there is also another part of me that says, you know, don't trust this kind of wave that happens usually at this point in time of the year. In one month time, there's going to be no one around, there's going to be nothing to do, you're going to be alone by yourself again. So yeah, as much as I try to be involved uh, in this release of energy that happens at the center of summer, uh, I am to some extent also detached and I also look at it with some kind of suspicion, let, let's say. Uh, not always, not all the time, but I have my moments where I kind of detach myself from reality and I look at it from a sort of an external point of view. This is something that happens always to me and it has always been happened to me. Um, I've been that kind of person that likes, you know, to kind of step aside and reflect on things. Sorry if I move my hair, but there are flies and probably wasps buzzing around me. But anyway, last night a friend of mine celebrated his birthday and I kind of slept in the open air under the stars, uh, really enjoyed it and this morning I woke up early and 
decided to go for a morning swim just to clear my mind and reflect on things. Uh, there's still no one here. In a few hours, there's going to be plenty of people because this spot is pretty well known. And, and I try to avoid it, uh, at least at this time of the year, even though I love it. It's really beautiful. There are fishes in the water. They like to nibble on your body. Uh, there are birds flying over your head. Cicadas chanting. I mean, what else? What else? What else do, do you want? I don't know what else do you want. There's people that don't like these kind of things. There's people that like uh, luxury. There's people that like to show off things on, on social media, uh, like dinners and plates and this and that. But I am pretty content with nature. And I think that enjoy, enjoying nature is the greatest richness of it all. And uh, I, try, I try to do it as much as I can. I try to follow what I like because there is kind of a magnetic pull there and it's kind of interesting when you let yourself go down the road that you like. It's kind of interesting to see what happens, you know, it's something that sparks your spirit. I mean, what else are you supposed to do if you don't do what you like? Of course, you have to do it with your head screwed on on your shoulders. You don't have to be crazy and compromise your future. But life is short and it's been going pretty quick in the last years. At least for the last couple of years, for me, I've been quick. I've been quick and I feel like I feel like life passed me, I feel like life passed beside me and I didn't even notice and, um, and that's not good. I've been kind of asleep for, for a good time and I think it's time to do something about it because it could end, it could end with no notice. Just yesterday, a few rocks fell from the cliff right there and they were taking out an entire family almost so you know and you're gone and you're gone okay i feel like i'm rambling right now this video doesn't really have a script i just came down to the river meditated a little bit went for a nice morning swim, done my breathing exercises and I wanted to I wanted to talk to someone so I decided to turn on the camera and press play because I wanted to clear my mind and um, and also yeah to see what you think how is life treating you These years went past for you too. Many people seem to say that for the last 3-4 years. I just wanted to notice that summer is going quick, this year is going quick and I want to enjoy it and I want to try to be mindful and I would like to find a balance between planning things out, living in the moment and yeah, enjoy life and be content. And I am content right now. I am enjoying this moment. I feel like him in. I'm I feel like I am into it. And let's say I wish you all the best, make the most of it, take care. And I'm rambling and rambling.